Guys, big gooch. Today is the day. I'm very excited for this one. Um, some of you may have seen the little teaser I made quite a few weeks ago for the M140 Beamer. It's happening. I'm on my way right now. So, the reason it's taken a while is simply down to that 140i. M Sport Beamer needs running in. It's brand spanking new. And Anthony, the guy that owns it, quite rightly didn't want to thrash it until it was running properly. Um, so it's only recently been running, but since then we've had holidays, etc. So it's ready. Um, so a little bit about the car it is literally three months old, if that. It's brand new, it is the BMW 140M, circa 350 brake horsepower, 368 foot-pounds of torque, which is a lot of torque. I've driven, re well, relatively fast cars, um, up to 300 horse I would say. Um, this is easily the fastest car that I've ever driven. and. Anthony's been kind enough to say, look, if you want to do a launch in it, go right ahead, you're absolutely fine to do that. Um, pretty nervous about it, and I'm not going to lie, there will be no chucking it around from my part, although I will ask Anthony to take me out for a ride and thrash it. <laughs> The 8 speed ZF transmission, paddle shifts, of course. Note 60, I believe, for the auto is about 4.6 seconds, which is seriously good for a rear wheel drive machine. Well, I think it is anyway. You've got your 3 litre straight six turbocharged engine in there, which apparently is a peach and it loves to rev. As some of you will know, the turbocharged cars don't particularly like to rev, they run out of puff at the top end. From what I've read, this is not the case with the 140i. So I'm interested to see how how that feels. Um, oh, and a little gem for you: when he bought it, he was he was adamant that he was going to get the uh, BMW performance exhaust on it, which he has. And he was asking me, he said, "Look, uh, what would you what would you recommend in terms of um, rear silencer? Because you can have two finishers. You can have the standard, you know, the, the stainless steel chrome tip." Um, which looks a bit samey, doesn't it? Uh, no, no, no. So go, go right ahead. Go right ahead for the carbon tips. Get those carbon tips. And um, I thought I left it out with the promo video because uh, the exhaust looks really nice. Uh, lovely carbon surround on the actual tip with the little um, M, M emblem badge on it.
car that hard, but that pulls that hard in four. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. That just goes. Man, it's, it's, it's extremely fast, but it feels really safe. It feels like it can easily do it. And some cars feel fast, but scared shitless. You know. This is a... Uh, Struggling to think of stuff now because it, I'm thinking it's relatively small and light, it's really powerful. The traction control just kind of went, yeah, 
little bit, we'll just take a little bit off you. And that was it. Yeah. Come on, Sam, out of the way! Out of the bloody way! Oh yeah, we got tech kids in there all the time. Look at the log. <laughs> yeah. That's full log. Yeah. <laughs> One turn, full log. Clean to neutral, hand like on, press park. There you go. Whoa. Off he goes. Brilliant. What a car. Really impressed with that. I know some of you will be thinking, oh, it's not that fast. It, it is fucking quick. It's a fast car, that. It's a really fast car. Um, like Anthony said, it makes me wonder what a 600 horsepower car must feel like. But um, speed wise, that just, it's so fast. You can just be up to very high speed in a matter of seconds. It's quite, it's quite very impressive. Good noise as well. Um, so, yeah, a little bit different this time because I didn't want to, I didn't have the balls to start chucking it around. And, you know, I respect for Anthony, it's his car. And, I wouldn't ask, I wouldn't put him in that position to have to ask him if I could do that, so. Um, bit of a shame that van held us up, up solely brow, because I reckon we could have had a bit of fun with that S3. Um, but yeah, great car, very, very powerful. And that launch I did was great, up to 16. You can believe it's four and a half seconds. So yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, spread the word, um, and I'm sorry it took so long to get this video up, once again thank you very much for taking the time out to watch it, massively appreciate it, and I'll see you next time.